Hello, my name is Brian Weeks and I'm a Senior AEC Technical Specialist for ATG USA. And today, in Autodesk Revit 2020, I'm going to talk about displaced views. Displaced views can be used to illustrate the relationship that model elements have to the model as a whole. Displaced views are similar to exploded views but provide flexibility by allowing the displacement of selected elements or all elements. This tool is available in a 3D or perspective model when you select one or more model elements. So I'm going to go ahead and zoom in on my building model and I'm going to select the elements on this canopy. And when you move up to the top to modify view, under that is displace elements. By clicking on that button, it creates a displacement set, which also gives you a couple more options to edit the set, reset the set, or create a path for the set. So first thing I'm going to do is go ahead and move this perpendicular to the facade so we can see the elements that I've selected. Now, as you can see, I've missed a couple of elements. The great thing about displacement sets is that if you select edit, you can add or remove elements from your set. So I'm going to add some of these items that I missed and hit finish. And now I have a displacement set of the canopy that's offset from the building. I might mention that this only occurs in this view. In other parts, in other views of the model, this canopy is still attached to the facade. To show the path, all I have to do is click on the path command, and it will actually create dashed lines to show the path that it has been offset. Now, with this line, you can actually modify it to your liking. Uh, so if your company wants a standard you know, red line offset or a dash dot, then you can change those in the line settings for the offset path, for the displacement set path. I'm going to do the same thing with this wall, just to show that you can do full wall systems. And again, it created a displacement set. I can show the whatever offset lines I need to show for the path. And there you go. Thank you for joining me today on talking about displacement views. And if you have any requests for additional uh, quick tips uh, or would like to see some other content, please email us or go to our website, atgusa.com. Thank you and have a great day.